Hey y'all, it's the next day. I just got, got ready to go bowling with my family. I'll show y'all the fit later on, but. To go <laughs> I took the orange out of the same evil and blended it. Yeah, I know you be eating, but you should blend it. Yeah, I know you be eating, but you should blend it. channel i don't know what that is i put it on the screen but right now y'all i'm about to go make a few errands i gotta go to the bank beauty supply because my scalp is on fire then go to Publix for some coffee stuff and then i'm gonna come back home i'm gonna get some ice from sonic i don't know what i'm gonna eat tonight y'all i might try to find something out of Publix. if not i don't know I'm just not like in the mood for, for eating anything, y'all. But I'm about to head out. It's so good. It's a little chilly out here. I have my coat in the car, though. I do have on a jacket. Okay, y'all. While my car is warming up, I just want to like talk to y'all real quick. Y'all, my mind is like, I feel like I've been still all day because I've been in my brain all day. Like, um, whew, like, I was stressed. Like, I stayed up to like three something this morning looking at apartments, didn't really get nowhere. So, I waited today, open today. I called a few places. One place called me back, and one place answered out of like five places. I scheduled a tour for one place, but they're a little pricey. So I'm like, I don't want to cancel it. I might change it to see could I get it changed to a Saturday tour if they're open on Saturday because I didn't think about Saturday. But like, they're a little pricey. So like, I might go just to still look, just to see what the vibe is, you know? Do I want to do that or not? But I don't think I'm gonna pay that much for an apartment. And I could like, get better with a house and cheaper with a house. So, um, but yeah, I've been in my head all day about creating content. like my to-do list stuff about my cousin's wedding i gotta find somebody to alter the dress should have been did that probably and um i'm like i think i'm not calling this place to do like some finger ways for the wedding so like i'm gonna see about that later on this week seeing can i like schedule an appointment hopefully i can get appointment in later in this month later on this month and then just see what her, you know, how she's gonna be, how she gonna, what's her style, how she gonna do my hair or whatever. And then, like, to confirm if I want her to do my hair for the wedding. And I feel like I'm falling behind on it. I feel like I got wedding shoes. I might end up ordering some more wedding shoes. And then I need to have my hair and stuff situated for the wedding or whatnot. I just need to get out of my head. Cause I'm feeling like, really, I'm really feeling like it's gonna keep bothering me until I change it. Like, I can't make the content I want for real or I can't just like whew, have a free mind if I'm not in the space that I want to be in because I feel like if I get in the space that I want to be in then I would be a better a, I mean a better youtuber like a better content creator I want to be a content creator a vlogger like I want to move up from content creating like yeah, cutsy gray is cool, but when you start to influence and be a positive influencer, like, I want to be an influencer. So, it's just, like, I have to work my way up to that, but, like, I just have to learn to live in Tierra's world. And I wrote that yesterday in my planner. I said, and I was watching Shady by Jade. No, it was, like, No Shade by Jade. Her name is Jade. I was watching her video. And she said, she was talking about Twitter or whatever, social media. Yeah, they're like, that's a distraction these days or whatever. But she was like, I just have to learn, like, to live in my own world. And I was like, dang, I need to do the same thing. I just feel like I be caring about stuff that just really ain't got nothing to do with me. Like, really, what you think of me 
what you think you know about Tierra. It's like I have to let you think that. Like, what you think about my content, my vlogs, like who I am as a person, I have to let people think that. So, because that has nothing to do with me, it has everything to do with them. Because when have you taken the time to get to know Tierra or watch Tierra's vlogs and like see what I'm about? You know, like just be a genuine, like in a genuine way. You know what I'm saying? So, it's just like. I couldn't worry about what folks think. But I do feel like some things bother me like when I'm not in the space personally where I wanna be. So, and that just ties into like my atmosphere, like my apartment, like my goals that I put on my vision board. I have different opportunities coming to me. I got like a different job opportunity that came to me and I don't feel like, I'm not gonna say I don't feel like I can do it, but it's just like right now, it's just like, dang, that money will be awesome. But it's just like, I really can't commit to that because my school and my YouTube and God is coming first. Like, God's gonna always come first. But when I focus on my you, my school and my YouTube, like, that's what's coming first to me. And that's what I have to remember, like, to, like, get out of my head and live in TJNA's world. go bowling with my family I'll show y'all the fit later on but y'all I'm kind of feeling these lips which I think but I will see y'all get there on the film so bowling action so hopefully I'll win tonight we'll see that's all I got tea day okay y'all I think I like this better we about to go bowling I me mean, Eric and Chris I'm driving to the bowling alley it's the next day. Y'all, I'm kind of feeling these lips. Just natural, natural beauty type. Oh, that's bright. Y'all, I'm kind of feeling these lips, y'all. What y'all think? I kind of feel cute tonight. But I'm going to try to get, maybe my brother, somebody take pictures of me there. Now I need thumbnails and I don't be active on Instagram. I might try to post something so I'll see. We'll see, but cause y'all I'll be um I don't care to post no more. So I'm gonna try to do like maybe I feel like some cute body whole body pics would be cute, you know. So I'll see what that's gonna be like. But for now, y'all, I'm just waiting on Eric and Chris. Like we had to wait for Chris to get here, but anyway, when we ready. I'm just letting the car warm up, but I will see y'all when we get there. That is all for now, TT babies. Hey y'all, it's the next day. And yes, I have on the same outfit. We end up not going bowling because of the bowling alley. It was like people. In the bowling league, it was like they night to bowl or something. So we ended up not going because it was, it was too crowded or whatever. But I had to go on this apartment tour by myself. Because um, my brother said he was going to go with me, but he's still in the bed. And I can't wait on him. I had to go on this tour by myself. And I didn't want to go by myself at all like I really do not want to do this by myself but I'm just trying to like revamp my baby hairs this side look a mess it's giving ball like I don't, oh, I'm gonna wash my I'm gonna wash my hair tonight 
I just really wanted my brother to go with me. Somebody's going with me. And I'm going by myself. But it should be good. Like, they're not open yet. They open at 8.30, I think. And my appointment's at 9 through 9.30. So, 30 to 20 minutes is not a bad time until look at an apartment. I really just want to go look. I don't think like I'm interested in getting this one. I just want to go see what the vibe is. Yeah, I'm about to do my lip combo. I'm gonna show y'all my little beauty supply. Got my beauty supply brown pencil. Wait, there we go. My white lip pencil. And then I'm gonna use my Fussy from Fenty, so I'm gonna show y'all how to do it. Just put it on, just line your lips. Okay, line them up real nice. I'm getting the shape of my lip up here. Okay, see that? Just outline the lips. I might do a little more on the bottom. Cause the white is just like, it's a lot of white you gotta fill in. It's like now we take the white one. And we just fill it in. We do an under on the top too. Yet it look crazy, but that's what the pink pink gloss is for. Put the pink over it. See, voila! See now. You gotta like, you gotta wait till it sink in, like. It just look crazy right now, but it's gonna settle in. Like. It's all gonna blend out. Okay, so. I think my car is done warming. I'm about to go. Cause that place is 20 minutes away. Stop. Oh, stop them. He's like, y'all right now, I'm about to get some jacks. I'm at jacks because I'm hungry. My stomach growling, wilding. I just want to tell y'all the apartment. I might tell you when I get home, park when I get home, but that apartment was so nice, y'all. But for 1500 or something dollars, I don't want to do that because... I can be paying mortgage, y'all. Like, I feel like I just need to get an apartment this way less than fifteen hundred something a month. It went just at fifteen, it was fifteen something a month, and then start off like that, and then um, for this year, like, just prepare myself to like buy a house after like I get set in my career. Krista, shout out to my sister. She just had a real good talk with me, y'all. Like, cause I almost said, I don't know. Like, I don't know about this dental school because it's the interest. It's not my first passion. So I just feel like when I do something, I need to be all in for it. Like, I'm, I'm in for it. I don't feel like it's like a deep rooted pet. Like, you know, like I'm not deeply passionate about it. But I do, I am interested. I want to do it. Like, I have built that interest. With, like, all the stuff I've been watching, I built that interest. So, hold on, y'all. Y'all, I just ordered me a four-piece tender meal. I probably, I'm a little tempted to add apple pie, but I ain't going to do that. I ain't going to do that. But I just got me a four-piece. Tender meal from Jake's. 
I ain't been Jack's in a while, so I was like, why not get Jack's? Because I was craving McDonald's. Anyway, I'm about to go back home and eat this. But yeah, Crystal, y'all, she just spoke all the sense I need right back into me. Like, because I was going to say, forget school. I just want the money. That's what I'm focused on. Like, but at the same time, I want that financial stability. We have to talk about that stability, that income, that consistent income. Because, you know, like, I work with kids. So when you work with kids, like depending on what school zone, if you work at a church, if you work at a school, if it's a private school, if it's a public school, like we all get paid different. Like when I was with Jefferson County, I was getting paid monthly. I got paid once a month. And that's a struggle because like you got to stretch and really budget your money out. But now like where I'm at now, at the church, I get paid every two weeks. But, like, when school is out, we follow Shelby County. So, when school is out, we not... It's like the money is out. Like, we out when the school district is out. So, it's just like... I have to take everything I want into consideration. My, Crystal, shout out to you. She was just like, take all of your... Everything you're doing with dental school, everything you finna do, like, Tierra, this is gonna fund your passion, your nails, and other stuff I wanna work on, like, it's gonna fund what I want. You know what I'm saying? Like, so I had to understand, like, because I really just wanna say forget it and jump right into nails. I was calling nail schools this morning, calling different, different apartments about apartment tours. Like, I'm really trying to, like, follow what's on my vision board my dream board like that's the dream lifestyle i have for myself like and the standards that i set for myself so like me having my vision board is it's just not i'm telling y'all my vision board ain't just there to look cute i put it on my wall it's up there because i'm really looking at it and like praying over it and manifest manifesting like everything i want over my life so it's just like it ain't just there for no reason. It's there because I'm working towards something. And Krista just had to remind me, like, and I, that took me back to the day, like, another conversation, like, right when I was getting enrolled in school, when I was talking about, like, when I was talking to my mama, like, I just really want to be, like, I need that stability. And when I say that, I'm not talking about money. I'm just saying, like, career-wise, like, I know I won't. A career dental assistant might not be my top career but it has been my interest for a long time dental has been an interest for a very long time and then nobody know that I could tell y'all back it had been around like 2017 2018 when I first got interested in dental but um I just didn't tell nobody so I feel like I need to get refocused and I was just really trying to make up I was trying to like I was really stressing myself out um yesterday y'all so, um, like, I, I could sh overthink so hard and stress myself out, y'all, to the point I'd be crying. And I have a whole migraine. Like, that's where my bad migraines be coming from. But anyway, Crystal just had to remind me, like, why I started in the first place. Like, why, Tierra, why do you want to do this in the first place? That's what she just reminded me of. So, yeah, like, and then, now that I'm reminded of what I want, like, why I'm doing it, it just motivates me even more to keep going. Like, I don't have a reason to, like, not want to do dental school. Cause I'm, and then my classes are, like, every Saturday. The course is, like, from April, my last day in school is July 22nd. From April to July. Like, classes every Saturday. I have, like, throughout the whole week to be studying. So, it's just, like, I have it easy with that. If I could just go ahead and get this out of the way... And then build my nail career up. Whatever I gotta do, whatever I gotta do, my nails up. If I gotta travel, if I gotta do it in my apartment, to work my way up to a studio that I want, cause I really want a studio. I was telling her that today. So it's just like, if I can do that, then I got this in the bag. I just be overthinking, being overworked in my brain, like stressed for no reason. So. And I had told my friend, told Kim, I was like, I'm really, 
thing am I saying forget dental school because it's not like a deep passion but it's a passion like I like it it's an interest but it's not a deep passion but it'll get me somewhere where I want to be but anyway I'm finna head home but I just want to tell y'all how it went why am I going this way anyway I just want to tell y'all how it went y'all I'm in the process of making a TikTok I'm quarantining right now because I have COVID I'm in the process of making a TikTok and it requires me to pick my favorite YouTube video, which I think I have one, but at the same time, I really don't. And it's just taking me through like memory lane. Like, <laughs> my YouTube is not where I want it to be, but it's going somewhere. Like, progress is progress. I just need to stay consistent and get back to the what I really love and that's hair and makeup. I mean especially makeup but like I sit here and watch my first three. This is my third video ever. One I feel like this is my favorite intro. But anyway. Anyway y'all I just feel like this is bringing tears to my eyes because like I'm really doing something I've been wanting to do. And look how pretty I am. Like, I was really feeling this. I, I don't think I want to go back natural though. But when I grow my hair out, I'll be doing my braiding curls again. Like, I want to get back to, like, why I started my YouTube in the first place. Like, this is back when, I like, nobody, the aesthetics, it was just, like, really it's be yourself. Awesome. You know what I'm saying? Like, just be yourself. Like... This is my most popular video. Like, it's just really, um, it's just really making me a little teary eyed. I just, like, I have to pick up the camera. I haven't picked up the camera in a second, and I am quarantining. But, y'all. <laughs> I just can't believe it. I'm just really trying to go through my videos and see do I have a favorite video, but like it's really making me teary eyed because I'm really oh, soft, doing something so soft. that like, I said oh I wanted to do and I'm still doing it even though I haven't right. been super consistent. It should be more videos than this, but I'm no growing. Flakes, no crunchiness. The wet line doesn't give it, make it hard. This is it's back so when I was doing makeup on YouTube. I'm about to get back to it. I just re-inspired myself. Yes, I will go over these baby hairs. I think eight this one's my favorite video. Satisfied. My cringy rap tutorial. Y'all should go watch it. <clears throat> but y'all, like dead serious. Like <sighs> I'm about to cry. Like this makeup stuff is my true love. I love it. I love it. It goes great with my makeup. Just feeling myself. Soft, like, my curls is popping. Like, oh my goodness. Look at that. Look at those curls. I love it. I can't get over this. I'm happy I did it. I'm happy I did it too, boo. <laughs> Look at y'all. This is everything to me. This is everything to me. So, today, I did a makeup tutorial. Hey, so this is what I'm really good at. Let me stop playing with y'all. But yeah, y'all, anyway. if you want to see how I got this look, stay tuned. It was a struggle. You'll see I why. might pop back out with the cringy watching. rap tutorials for y'all too. Right here, y'all. I'm just underlining my, first my brows. Only one I did. With my LA my girl concealer. I'm about to use it as a guide for me filling in the rest of my brows. I'm not done filling my brows yet. I think this is my favorite video. I want y'all to hear me Brand in the top of my brows so I can have more of a natural look. Hey, hey, boop, I 
that. Mm 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 I know you be in me, but is you blending in? <laughs> I took the orange out of the same. So it's time to blend this contour out, and I don't want to see no straight line up under it, because it's tacky, and, and it's wacky, and, and that's all facts, facts so don't at, at me, period. <laughs> I think somebody's watching me. So funny. I just got to my car. My skin looks really good through camera, y'all. I just moisturized my face. I'm trying to see why she's watching. I don't know what she's doing, but anyway. So, some face mask up from Amazon. My face mask holder. <clears throat> Before I go. Y'all, people cannot drive. Let me lock my door. People cannot drive. And it really just makes my butt itch. They need to fix these two lanes over here by this gas station. Because ain't no way. Ain't no way. These people thought there was one lane. I'm sick of it. Already. I've been out for two seconds. For two seconds. And these people are still cutting up. But anyway, y'all, I need to clean my car out, too. It's going to be a long night. It ain't going to be a long night. I'm not going to claim that for myself. I'm going to do my hair. I might clean my car out, you know, <clears throat> then do my hair or whatnot. But, yeah. I'm not going to hurry up and go because you just cannot sit at the gas station for too long. That's just I don't know. Just whatever you are. My car, baby. I came out the wrong way. I need my alignment ASAP. Like it should have been done a long time ago. What was the last thing I got? Last thing I got on my car was an oil change. And that oil change was very much overdue. But this, this alignment gotta get done. Like, it ain't gonna be this coming up week. It gotta be the next coming up week. Like, cause it's a mess. And then people like, people be watching what I'm doing. Don't watch what I'm doing. Just ask for the channel. This is my latest reaction clip. It's called Exhibition like, Direct and Oil Bottle. They have the bottle. I don't know if I need normal or if I need extra strength. Wait, I don't know. I only got the relaxer clips and. What else I got? And some do bro. I don't think I'm gonna record the whole hair process because it's not a hair video, but I'll see about that. But I'm on my way home. I really, really like want a meal, like a home cooking. I think I just, I'm just really want some rice or something. Like I don't know what I, what it is, but I want a meal. Y'all, this is what I got so far. They have this lotion. It is shea and coconut butter. See it. I came over here for a pita light. The pita is six dollars. I might change my mind and just get a thing of Gatorade. Came here for these three dollars. I don't know if I want both of these, but I'll have to see. But I don't know what I'm about to buy. Yeah, I just came on here to show y'all how long my hair get in before I mold it or whatever. I don't want to mold it down. I'm gonna mold the size. I feel like I can do like some little curls in the morning before I go. So I'm gonna do that and see. 
I'm going to insert a picture, but with short hair, you can still have like the little swoop curls. I don't know. I'll go on Pinterest and show y'all a picture. But I just want to see, show y'all how long my hair is getting. I'm like, y'all, I need to be cutting this, but I'll wait till <clears throat> either before the bridal shower or before the wedding for it to get cut because it's getting, it's getting cut, cut for the wedding. Straight finger wave mode, but I just wanted to show y'all. Hey, y'all, it's the next morning. I just want to show y'all how I parted my hair. Um, based on like how I think I can curl my hair, but those my edges didn't lay down last night. But um, I'm just gonna show y'all me curling my hair. My hair is y'all. My hair just keeps getting longer and longer. So I'm thinking like it could be like a little not bang action, but. You know, like with the curves and with the part. Because all of it's long. All of it needs to get cut. But I just want to come on here and show y'all how I'm parting my hair before I start curling or whatever. Ugh, my hair feels so good. It's so late. I should have been through a way to other relaxes and um just um go get a fresh new pack of relaxer. I think that was the issue. So why I was so under process because it wouldn't it would not do right. And I'm gonna show y'all <clears throat> the flat iron I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use this one. Now in the beauty supply last night they had the um the one that's thinner than this one. I might go back and get that because they only got one more left. It was twenty four dollars. I ain't one for twenty four dollars. I think about it, it's probably the same price on Amazon. But I'm gonna see how this works and I'll be back. I just curled my hair and then flipped it over and painted it. <clears throat> but I will, I'm going to do my little sideburns and my little baby hair. And then I'm going to show y'all how it turns out when I take the clips out. Because it's almost time for me to go. Yeah, I got to go. But I just wanted to show y'all my hair. Now, this is the best I can do right now. Because I'm about to go. I just took my little feather comb and, like, just swooped it out. Like some of the curls, but I'm, like, swooping them to the side. It don't look too bad, but the back is too, um, it's too long for this. So I need, like, the little curlers. I'm going to go to the beauty supply and get the little ones. But this is, best I, this is the best I can do for now. I'm about to head to go babysit and then grocery shop. I'm trying to see if I want to take y'all with me or not. But, yeah, I'm about to do that real quick.
January 31st, y'all. Tomorrow's gonna be February. We all think about that. I am letting my car warm up because I'm on the way to go nanny. I'm a nanny. I watch two babies, y'all. A boy and a girl. Until 5.30. So 7.30 to 5.30 I'm watching my babies. But I'm just letting my car warm up. I just wanted to show my face. I wanted to show y'all like me kind of getting ready. So after I got up, I put my clothes on first. It was a little backwards this morning. I usually get up, brush my teeth, wash my face. But today I just put my clothes on. Pick my clothes out, then put my clothes on. Then I washed dishes, fixed my breakfast, sat down and ate. That's the best part. And I read my little today's devotional thing. Jesus is calling devotional. So um, I sat down at 8, read that, watched a little TV on my iPad, cleaned my dishes out um, before, in the process of before me fixing breakfast. I fixed my lunch. I kind of showed y'all me cleaning my lunch box out. I changed my purse this morning. I'm feeling much better, y'all. So much better. Um, I didn't need like no blood transfusion or nothing, so I'm feeling really good since COVID. Whew. I just wanted to show my face to check in. Everything is good, y'all. Everything is good. I had the best sleep last night, y'all. Cause night before, let me see, Sunday night, Sunday, yeah, Sunday I babysat, and I was drinking coffee. I had coffee. I was drinking, sipping on coffee out of my cup all day. But I had eaten breakfast. I had Fritos. I was eating Fritos and coffee. But anyway, until I got home and I ate dinner. So I was thinking, man, I need, I need to go to sleep because I got to wake up early because I got to go nanny at 7.30 in the morning, y'all. I didn't go to sleep until um 3.30 a.m. So, and then I got up at 6.30 a.m. Then I had to go nanny two babies, y'all. And I was fighting my, it, it wasn't like I was going, I was in those and not fighting my sleep. I was just like, my body didn't feel exhausted, but I knew I was tired. I was tired, but I was up. I was like, oh my gosh, how am I still up? But God, <clears throat> he paved the way for me because what if I was like really sleepy and was like dozing off? Like you can't do that with two babies, but that didn't happen. So I was just like, oh my gosh. But I took the babies on a walk after their second nap, like after two o'clock or whatever. Took them on their second walk. I needed that walk because it woke me up. <gasps> and then they needed a walk too, so it really helped. But that's all for now, folks. My camera is dying. I will see y'all later. That's all for now, TT babies. Hey y'all, it's the next morning. I just want to show y'all what I told y'all I would show y'all what I got out of Target. Some of I got out of Walmart the other day. Just like refilling all my hygiene stuff. It's not everything, but this is just some stuff I bought. But last night, I picked up this exfoliating body polish. Dove, it is crushed almond and mango butter, y'all. It smells so good. It's at a Walmart by my job. It's like a little, the little market Walmarts, like not the big one, but like the little Walmarts. I love those. I got my face moisturizer out of Walmart too, cause it's a little cheaper than Walmart. I got this lotion out of Publix, 
the other day while I was grabbing some chips that I wanted. And I've been wanting a different baby lotion scent. And I've been using this because um, the kids, like, when I wear my expensive perfume or, like, if I decide to do, like, Bath and Body Works or Victoria's Secret Body Spray, like, they break out. Not break out, but, it, like, they already be sensitive. And then they just sneeze a lot when I wear, like, body spray and my expensive perfume. So I don't want to waste my expensive perfume no more. So last night in Target, I got these L tampons. I got it in light and regular. Y'all, I'm not going to kill with y'all. I've never worn a tampon. I'm 28. I've never worn a tampon in a day of my life. So last night, after I recorded for y'all, I um went on YouTube and watched two videos of how to insert it because the little plastic part, I was like, do you put that plastic the hard plastic part in you too and then like i just didn't know so i had to make sure because i've never been a tampon girl i wanted to make sure i did it the right way so i got these Wait. and they come in like this cute little package it's not like that loud hard plastic either it's that um like real soft plastic material and they're really like these are really good so i put like i put about six of them in my purse for today i don't know how much i need and y'all i put a panty liner i put two panty liners in my panties just in case i leak in case i didn't do it right but i have extra in my purse so i'm gonna tell y'all how that goes if y'all want to know maybe that's a little tmi but i just want y'all to know like Comment down below if you're a tampon girl or you're a pad girl. I'm really a pad girl, but I feel like I need a change. I wasn't. I can't, like, I always have a problem with pads. I'm very sensitive, too, so it's just like, ugh. has to take place. I'm not just in this thing on my own. Have you ever realized what it's like to have backup when you thought you were in something on your own and then you realized out of nowhere that there were people who would be there for you, that God would send people right where you needed them? Manner so that I can play on. Yeah, I remember those days like first time This like notebook. Okay, y'all, so I had to find a different scenery where it's a little bit quieter, but this is one of the notebooks that i bought for school from target i have two of these so i made one like my bible study notebook i have um i have one already so i just wanted to start a new one for this year and y'all last night the video i showed y'all wait let it focus um the Sarah Jakes Roberts video I was watching called Headwinds it was really, really good. So I took my notes, took some notes. I took really good notes, y'all. I don't know why it's being blurry, but then there's my series, True. And out from that study, she was an ex, so. I think I'm gonna start doing X because I like how she was teaching what she was preaching last night, and it was in X ten. So I'm gonna start X from the beginning, but I'm also gonna read X. The vision. Y'all see that? Okay, y'all, I was too close to the Bible, so it wasn't focused, but it's Cornelius Vision. That's the book that she talked from, so it's Acts 10, uh, Cornelius' Vision. So, and then it goes into Peter's Vision, and then Peter's visit to Cornelius, and it goes all the way to the Gentile conversion and baptism so i'm gonna read this i think i'm gonna start reading 10 and then i'm gonna go back to verse 1 
to read the whole acts together. But that's all I have right now. I just wanted to show y'all that that's where I'm started. And I have some my little heart things to write notes on to. So that's what I'm about to do while I have a little time here. But um, Sarah was pretty much just talking about your vision, who can you trust with your vision. Um, we don't post about it, we pray about it. Um, you're waiting on something, so like, when you're waiting on something, don't rush what God has for you. You don't have to tell everybody your vision because you have to know the people that you trust with your vision. Just like, um, was it Peter or Cornelius? One of them chose like the like three top people for their vision. So, um, and she also talked about you have to be willing to have your mind changed by God. Um, and speak like you already have it. Like, I will graduate. I will have my own. I will do nails. I will grow my YouTube. So, like, I just have to, like, change my mindset like I already have it and trust the waiting season. But while I'm trusting the waiting season to not shrink myself to make outsiders and people who don't belong comfortable. So, it was really good. I think y'all should go watch it. It's called Headwinds by Sarah Drake's Roberts. It's a summer from two years ago, but that does not matter because it was needed. Hold on. Am I zoomed in? Whoa. Okay, so yeah. It was very much needed, y'all. So, I just wanted to come in here and show y'all that because I haven't shown my face in a while and I just feel like I'm vlogging, but I'm not getting anything. So, I just wanted to show y'all that. But I'm gonna go back to work. So, um, I'll talk to y'all later. That's all for now, TVs. Feelings of mine, I think it's of mine